Hello and welcome to another Spirit Island video. Today I'm going to be doing another custom spirit spotlight, this time of Songweaver. Uh, this is, as always, a spotlight from the Spirit of Creation Discord. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, and basically I'm just going to show off the spirit and I'll play probably a couple games, both this video and like probably another video. But yeah, so to get started, the flavor is Songweaver first took form as a migrant spirit, singing praise to its surroundings as it traveled with the winds and waves. Upon meeting the Dahan, it settled on the island, joyous to find others to sing for and with. Some Dahan have noticed how Songweaver's songs stir the elements. Singing by its side, the Dahan can borrow its connection to nature and bring about their own workings of power. Intrigued by this, Songweaver has begun to sing harmony to their melody, changing itself in turn. These changes have become more urgent after recent incursions by the invaders. So set up, we start with two persons on the board, lowest with Dahan and highest with Dahan. Four cards as usual, zero energy, and importantly we have these eight chorus cards. Um, so this is a spirit that somewhat like starlight will be like shaping itself as the game goes on with lots of different directions except the also i guess a combination of starlight and uh wounded waters bleeding like the chorus cards are somewhat similar to healing cards is my understanding so playstyle apparently you can play this without reading the chorus cards i'm probably going to briefly skim over them because i do tend to like Part of what I like to do with these custom spirits is like play test a bit like on balance because I think that's one of my strengths as a player. Uh, but yeah, so we want to keep Dahan alive, mitigate Blight. Uh, we don't have many ways of dealing with built up lands, um, but uh, Chorus Powers can change uh, our game plan. Uh, and we use a bunch of tokens. I assume this is like tied to the different courses and very high of course uh so let's look at the front of the spirit board Ooh, lots of cards well okay yeah th these are the chorus cards i'm going to set them off to one side for now but uh we have a nice spirit marker um let's see we are a zero one one spirit uh interesting so on reclaim we can immediately claim a chorus card so that's a very interesting time to claim a card. We can just, uh, we, we, we can like immediately claim one if we want, but if we don't care about growing, that is. Um, so our special rules, Dahan attuned to nature's harmonies. So we can attune element markers to specific Dahan, uh, and then Dahan have plus two health per attuned marker. Um, and it's, and we can like save those Dahan by destroying our presence instead. Uh, oh, by anything except damage. Okay, so the Dahan aren't. Uh, it, it's it's just the uh, like um, what's it called? The Hearth Vigil text kind of. Um, except not just for events and fear cards or events and light cards. I don't know. Uh, you have eight course cards. Yep. Okay, great. This is just telling us how course cards work. We claim one like this. Uh, okay, so we look to be a. So zero one one, we end at five energy, five plays, which is a lot, but like you know zero one one, so that's to be expected. Um, we have three elements on our tracks, which are first chorus element twice and once for the second chorus element. Um, so we can, we can claim two chorus cards total, um, and then we get to. Move presence, reclaim one. It's a pretty early reclaim one, but I guess this is a zero one spirit. Zero one one spirit. We have some Dahan movement. And we have some attunement stuff there. I assume there's other ways to attune. Let's see. So left and eight. One range slow. Uh, so this counts unique powers. Interesting. So this wants us to play more unique powers. Um Oh, I see. Okay. So the reason why this counts unique powers is probably because eventually as the game goes on, we will replace this with the first chorus card. And so uh, in, in, naturally as the game goes on, we'll, we'll also play fewer unique powers. That's actually really neat design. I like this a lot. I just gotta say. Um, 
And then this power threshold counts Dahan in your lands. Um, so if we have two Dahan, then we get to attune a Dahan. Uh, great. And then four Dahan, we can uh, we can take the minor of power if we want. Uh, so basically, the, the four Dahan lets us like look at a card every turn. We don't gain a card net, but um, because like it, we either forget from hand to take to hand, or forget from discard to take to discard. I assume that's what this means by replace. Um, and then this is our second chorus card. Okay. Well, I'm going to get started. Um, don't want to spend too much time just looking at the spirit board, especially when I haven't played this at all. Well, I, I technically played an earlier version, but so let's do a random level six, and it looks like it is Russia. Okay, so uh, chorus cards. Uh, okay, first of all, actually set up uh, lowest numbered and highest numbered with Dahan. So one and eight. So let's see. Chorus cards, uh, I'm going to lay them out here. So we can just claim this chorus card whenever. Is there anything else that cares about attunements? Attunements do... Uh, maybe maybe something here. Uh, maybe something on the chorus cards. Oh yes, attuned Dahan. Chorus cards care about attuned Dahan. I see. Okay, so let's see. Sun chorus uh, lets us move presence with Dahan and uh, prevent builds and explores and just skip actions. Um, I see. So this is this is the skip actions uh, chorus card that might be powerful against Russia. This is uh, okay. This is a lot of text. Um, I oh yeah, I do remember like thinking that this was too much text on the cards, and I don't think I think this is still too much text. But like you know, that that's a design choice kind of. Um, not not one that I would prefer, but it's fine. Um, so you can okay you can rem, you can get elements from this yeah each removed thing get, grants you one element and you can uh push dahan and get fear sure that doesn't seem that powerful uh course earth uh Okay, your lands. Okay, so this is a oh, this is very powerful. I guess maybe less so against Russia, but it is a powerful defense ability. And then this one, uh, the, the innate, uh, gives you more health on Dahan, um, and without adding blight, deal damage equal to. Okay, uh. Okay, this is a weird, like, this is not stone. This is like, this cares about how much you def over defended by, basically. Well, not over defended, over health by. Uh, chorus plant. Uh, okay, so this, this lets you do more tokens. And this lets you uh, heal blight, add more tokens. This also seems strong against Russia. Um, this uh, is the beast one. It's just some damage, sure. Isolation along with control. Is it just control? Uh, oh, that's a lot of control. Wait. Huh, this, this seems very strong. And then this is uh, Damage, just very simple damage, and then this is I assume fear. Yeah, this is fear and downgrades. Uh, what mark one swap? Oh, okay. You can't like swap multiple times. Sure, that's somewhat confusing, but sure. Okay, great. Our initial explore is sands. Uh, so we will explore with Russia. Oh, I guess I should also look at what our cards do so this is one damage for dahan and slow and then like spread dahan out this is 
light healing but expensive. This is defend one for Dahan, defend one for each of your... Okay, so this is just a defend and this is... Okay, this is a one cost Dahan ad. That's interesting. Uh, okay... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. So, I think, okay, my instinct is to be, like, mini hearth vigil, basically. Um, also, my instinct is that I want, I ideally would want plant or, so the ones that I want are, like, plant, earth, air, sun like these ones seem good to me the other four seem like kind of mediocre i guess this one like probably does some amount of damage it does one damage and then kind of okay it, it's a bad ranging hunt kind of yeah, i mean i guess it's not that bad uh yeah it's kind of a bad ranging hunt and it costs a lot of animal uh, I'd rather go for either the blight healing and uh, and Daha and sorry and wild adding, or the control seems strong against Russia. Um, so I guess the question is like, when am I reclaiming? I kind of want to go like here, here reclaim, or maybe here, here reclaim. One of those two. Um, and it doesn't actually matter what my elements are. Okay, I guess one thing I don't like about this is, um, it, is that it, uh, like, it always triggers on, yeah, on these few turns, the first few turns. So our hand cost is either five or six, which makes it really hard to go here. So, like, we could theoretically go plus three energy, plus three energy, and then reclaim. But then we don't get the three plays. So I might as well go here, honestly, and take plus three energy. Um, yeah, because if I do this, then I only get five uh, with one instance of plus three energy. I only get five energy, so that so then this uh, will not. Uh, this just will not add Dahan. I think, and I think we want to add Dahan early if possible, uh, because it looks like this is a very um, Dahan centric spirit. Okay, so then if we want to go top track, I guess I guess one way to go bottom track is to like try to find things that are less expensive than these. But yeah. Uh, so what's our plan for these? I ideally want to take care. I want to like I want to solve one of the lands and let the other one blight. This one is easier to solve because of Daha, because it has a Dahan, but this one has a beast that I want to protect. Um, so if I, if I can get the gather, then this will defend three next turn with this, which like solves that. Um, I guess this turn I can like on slow gather here. Um, and then play this. It's just so weird that I don't care about my elements at all. Right now. If I can remove a blight, I probably want to remove a blight on slow. Um, if I if I play these two, then I get to oh, I get to deal a bunch of damage. Huh. So if I play these two, let's say I take three energy. This, right? And Move, place my presence here, maybe. So then I'll get to unleash cacophony. Yeah, I'll get to unleash cacophony in order to um, kill that. So I gather two Dahan, add a Dahan, unleash cacophony, push a bunch of Dahan. Then I don't even need to gather into here. That seems like a good plan. Okay. No fast powers. Skip the event. Build, build. So 
floor is what wins. Well, that's actually perfect because now what we can do is, uh, so this power, right? Uh, we're going to push an explorer here into, into this, I believe. And then we're going to downgrade the last explorer with our uh, slow power. Uh, and then and then we're going to use Thrive Together. So, so now this land is solved. So Thrive Together, uh, gather up to two Dahan, like this. And then either I will pay one energy in order to uh, add a Dahan. That just seems very good to me. Then I will unleash Cacophony here. Oh, actually, before that, I should uh, use this. Share songs. Um, oh, I guess amusingly, like, this almost... Uh, oh, no, I, I can put a second Dahan in here, I guess. That might work. Okay. Anyways, uh, so share songs. Um, I get to discard two minor powers from the deck, choose one of them. Uh, and then I get to either uh, I get to attune one of the Dahan and also uh, replace a power card in my hand or discard with one of them. Okay. Uh, well, I want to. I think I want to attune. Uh, it's either plant or uh, plant or air. Air is pretty appealing, honestly. So if I get an air Dahan, then next turn this I, I get to like isolate a land with air. Uh it's too bad that this is dealing four damage. But okay, basically whatever Dahan I get here, uh I'm am I taking that card? I'm probably not. Yeah, I'm pro I'm probably just doing these two. So then Unleash Cacophony is going to do, whoops, don't want to rotate my hand. Unleash Cacophony is going to do one fear, one damage per Dahan, which is three, uh, which will do that and get one fear. Wait, so Dahan have, oh, you can, you can attune something multiple times. Oh, that's interesting. Uh... Huh. If I can attune something multiple times, maybe I'm not supposed to add a Dahan. Oh, another Dahan in target land has. Okay, great. So I can't actually get two attunements right now. But we can build an invincible Dahan. <laughs> um, anyways, so Unleash Cacophony, this, where is this Explorer going? Probably it's going into here. Yes, probably into there. Uh, and then we have to push these three Dahan into as many different lands as possible. So, huh. I want to push, uh, okay, it's annoying to pick these up, but I want to push that one there. This one here, just group up Dahan, I think. The last one can go into this uh, wetlands. Or actually, maybe this one's supposed to be here, even though we're no longer grouping up Dahan, so it doesn't play around Cold Cold ASIM. But with the idea of, like, maybe we maybe want to defend this. Like, honestly, something I could do is I could trade a Dahan here. So let the four damage kill this uh kill this Dahan and leave this Dahan alive, have this blight kill the town, and then kill off this town as well. The problem is I can't prevent this build. Uh, if I can prevent this build though, like if I draft something that lets me prevent that build, I get I get very far ahead. Uh, neither of these help. So I don't think I'm going to replace one of my either of my cards with one of these. Um, well, I guess I can just reclaim here. 
I can reclaim in order to get air. Uh, interesting. So what if I do this? I'm just going like hyper aggressive here, maybe. No, that doesn't work. Because like the push doesn't. Yeah, this has to isolate somewhere with Dahan. Uh, if, if this were here though, I could theoretically push this this way. So I isolate and then I push up to do to Dahan and then this can bring this explore out like this theoretically. And then I defend no. Uh I would need a way to another way to gather Dahan. Also, I would need. Oh, also, I would need a. Uh, oh, I guess I can use the gather. No, I can't because I won't have the gather. Okay, great. Good talk. Good talk. Very interesting that you can like immediately reclaim and get one of these if it like really helps you. Any other fast things? Uh, I guess. Oh, I guess maybe I should think about whether I want animal. Um. I could reclaim and get animal, but that's actually really hard to trigger. Um, I would need to do threat. I would need to do the same turn for the animal threshold, which seems not worth it. Uh, does water do anything? No, it does not. Any other? F so fire is fast, but I don't have fire cards. Uh, also, I couldn't have attuned anyways. Um, I could attune sun. No, that doesn't work. Okay, time passes. Uh, yeah, I think I'm not reclaiming here. Lots of complex things to consider. Um, and I think this is what I'm doing. I'm going to trade here, taking a blight, and I'm going to defend this, and then hopefully this can do something. Uh, I think I want to take the gain of power card here. Um, do I want to take a major and forget either Cacophony or wins? Maybe. I think so. Major seems strong. It also lets me like manipulate, like maybe build towards it with the chorus element. Well, there's an Instruments of Their Own Ruin. Should I just throw that back because Instruments is a game warping card? I'm going to pretend I didn't draw Instruments because Instruments is a game warping card. Um, I guess I'll take Forests. Forests seems fine. Dissolve seems pretty bad against uh, Russia. I could also take Flowers. Um, I can't play any of these this turn, really. Uh, not if I want to do this. But yeah, forest seems fine. Uh, okay. I guess maybe I'm supposed to take twisted flowers. Probably not. Certainly, that would have been a lot better if I if, if I took instruments. <laughs> Okay, um, so then my plan is the same. Uh, I get to place a presence here uh, and gather this way. I guess I don't get to have uh, Dahan in here. I guess this will just, this presence will just die. That's fine, I guess. Um, so shoulder, I get to defend three here. And then exaltation will do something. Great. 
Oh, this is fast. Oh, I didn't realize my, this write innate was fast. Oh. Uh, interesting. Huh. Huh. So I guess I do get to double attune one Dahan. Um, interesting. Well, uh, let's do that. Uh, I don't think I want either of these, but I will uh, choose to attune the other Dahan, uh, the same Dahan with plant. Um, does this work how I think it works? Okay, if I had known that, then I wouldn't have pushed uh, so, first of all, I wouldn't have attuned to this Don Dahan. I would, would have just attuned to this Dahan. And then I would have pushed, uh, let's see, so I, I pushed to uh, the sands, the wetlands, and the other sands. Instead, I would push to sands, wetlands, and like this wetlands, and then gather into the sands like this. Um, so, yeah, so uh, it looks like, uh, it looks like this, right? So I would go push, 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 attune. Also, I couldn't have attuned in here anyways. I would have had to attune in either here or here, and I would have probably would have attuned here. Um, that just seems like the best place to attune. And then, so now this is a uh, double attuned Dahan. I'll do that. Uh, and it has six health. Uh, that seemed busted. Uh, <laughs> just, just gonna put it out there. That seems too good. Um, anyways, yeah, I'm not gonna take either of these. So, um, okay. Oh yeah, and the, and then I'm gathering this this way. And so right now I only have three in my land, so I can't even use the this thing anyways. But okay. So, vent. Uh, we are healthy one. So, choose a land with buildings, ravage there. Uh, sure, we can choose this land. Uh, so, this deals four damage, which will damage Dahan, and then uh, the, I'll get Tantra attacked. That's completely fine. Destroy two explorers among lands with beasts. Um, so, I guess this will get destroyed. So, that's. One fear, and where does this want to get pushed? Probably into here. We're getting another stage one. Uh, I don't think I want to deal with explore, explore town there. Actually, I mean, it's fine. So I'm going to bring another Dachon in. Yeah, no, this is just fine to deal with. Three or more Dachon, don't have that. Terra one. In each land with towns, destroy one Dachon. So one explorer per town. So this will get pushed into here, I think. Don't want to interfere with that. Okay, so sands will ravage. So this is gonna blight, destroying your presence, which is unfortunate, but that's fine. And then Dahan will counterattack. Uh, this doesn't do anything. So uh, the blight is great. We don't have to rush a six. Now our wetlands will build like so. And our explorer, sadly, only this wetlands is pocketed. But our explore is jungles. Okay. Okay. So now on slow, we get to do exaltation to move like so, healing this blight. Um, and I can also push presence again, bringing a Dahan. I think I want to push this way, maybe. Um. Yeah, okay. And then Yeah, and then we get to use our left innate. Uh I'm just going to downgrade this with our left innate. And that solves that. Okay, so next turn, uh what do we want to do next turn? Um ideally this would blight, but it's fine if it doesn't. We can just rush a six into here. 
if we're also dealing with this, we certainly don't need to blight this. Um, yeah, okay. Time passes. Okay, so let's reclaim here, I think. Oh, actually, are we reclaiming? I could just go place presence again and try to find a zero cost to play this with. Uh, I probably want to reclaim because of shoulder though. One, two, three, four, five, six, three. I guess we can just let this blight and counterattack. Yeah, no, that seems fine. So let's reclaim. Let's gain the miner. Um, okay, while we think about this, uh, what are we getting in terms of chorus cards? So this can be a defend four. We gather this Dahan in. We're just slowly shrinking our board. Um, so we can take plant in order to ice, uh, no, air. I think we should take air. Uh, so air lets us isolate some land. So we can isolate this land. Seems nice. And then push to Dahan bringing this explorer, uh, which can then get a defense six in here. Oh, we can even push a Dahan with a tap. Okay, yeah, great. Uh, uh, oh, okay. Uh, if we wanted to do air, then we... Oh, no, this is actually awkward because we can't get here because we want to tune one of these. I guess that's awkward. Um, oh, and I guess it's kind of hard to get the air anyways. Uh, but do I have to claim one? I assume I have to claim one. It's funny that I, I kind of don't want to claim any, uh, but that's probably fine. Uh, I guess guess I can take Earth for the innate. I don't want to play these two this turn, though. So it doesn't really matter. What threshold's this? None of these, really. Hmm. Really, I just need this to clear. So I'm going to gather this like this. And then that's four defense. So it's going to currently kill a Dahan. So I just need some way of moving Dahan, which doesn't really exist. Um, what else can I do? Uh, I guess Chorus Earth prevents... Sure, I'll take Chorus Earth. I, I really want to take Chorus Air, but I think this provides enough tempo to justify not... And, like, it is pretty good. Okay. Uh, and then in that case, I should probably take... Ren I mean, I guess I can't use Renewing Rain. Doesn't matter. I'm probably just going to replace it. Uh... Let's just play these two. Uh, oh, but I, I do actually just want the earth this turn. So maybe it's just good to play this. Yeah, I think so. Great. Uh, so I'm going to defend four here. And then the Dahan have plus one health. Uh, and the land will also have plus one health. So that's actually not going to blight, which is interesting. Then it's going to escalate into here. Or not escalate, rush a six into here. Uh, so then in that case, I want to, uh, let's see, so fast, I get to discard two powers. 
Uh, sure, I'll attune Earth here. Okay. So, I have... I, Dahan have plus two, plus two health, and the land has plus one health, right? Because of the Dahan... No, the, the, it has plus two health. Oh, okay. So this ha this land has four health and is defended for four. So it's taking two out of four damage, which will not be enough. Uh, and the Dahan are also taking two damage, which also will not be enough. That's pretty good. Okay, uh, then let's see the event. Cultural ASIM. Uh, replace that Dahan with a town. So this says... Whenever it would be removed, replaced, or destroyed by anything except damage, you may instead destroy one of your presents anywhere. I'm going to destroy this presence. In order, I'm going to choose this Dahan that's next to this city and destroy this presence to save it. So I don't need to turn this into a town. That's very nice. Uh, and then Beast Attack doesn't do anything. Uh, and Reckless Offensive also doesn't do anything. Great. So Wetland will Ravage. And as we've been over, this will not quite we're almost to fear but that's fine uh can i put that there i can probably put that there uh oh it means that that it asks that it russia six is there i guess wherever this goes we'll probably get russia six uh is that fine i think this is fine er Hmm. I guess next turn I want to do this. So I want to let it blight and then move in and forests it. Yeah, so I should just get a Dahan out. Okay, great. So I do think I am going to push this here and then rush a six into here. Okay. And our explore is wetlands with escalation. So let's escalate like this. And then put explore here. Okay, great. And then renewing rain does nothing. Time passes. Okay, so let's take three energy. Do this. So this is an earth. You don't get to play this card. Okay, so uh, let's put our presence there. So we get to gather a Dahan. Um, actually, can I put my presence here? Let's say I get get the attunement. The land will have plus two health, and the Dahan will also have plus two health. Uh, so that means that there will be... So this is dealing eight damage. Uh, that unfortunately would kill two Dahan, and I don't like that. I, I'd rather have it blight and kill one Dahan. So I'm going to place my presence here and... Uh, gather Dahan out instead. Okay. Uh, no fast powers. Oh, sorry. I do have a fast power. Uh, let's put it here, probably. Uh, I guess I don't have to choose yet, but... Uh, okay, great. Let's grab an air. I guess I can replace a card with this, uh, with one of these. Uh, probably Entrancing Apparitions on, instead of Renewing Rain. Seems good. Um, so let's attune this Dahan with air. Okay. Okay, let's see our event. It is Promising Farmland. Uh, sure. Add a beast to land without blight that has towns. That's rude. It's immediately going to get poached. Um, and defend one for Dahan. Sure, it doesn't do anything. Fear card. Uh... Oh, that's funny. These, so this is defended for one, and it also deals minus six damage to Dahan. So it'll blight, but the Dahan will counterattack. That's hilarious. Um, oh, sorry. This has a city on it. Never mind. Never mind. I forgot to build here, but yeah, this should have a city. I was like, huh, that looks not big enough. Um, 
Did I add an explorer instead of a city? Yes, I did. That's what happened. Because, uh, yeah, the, the, this had one explorer. It got pushed. Another explorer pushed in. No, 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 no. There actually should be three explorers. No, no, that, that was correct. Okay. So, yeah. Great. Minus six damage still won't save the Dahan here, unfortunately. Okay, so we poach a beast, sadly, on Ravage. We don't rush a six, which is nice. We build here, and our explore is Sands Mountains. Okay, so. A bit scary. But we should be fine. We'll need to deal with this. But, so now we get to do Exaltation in order to push. Uh, let's see. I think we don't want to take our uh, Earth Dahan into there. I think. Wait, do we have to? It may bring. Uh, yeah, so we, we can just like push these two like this. Yeah, there's no reason to do much else. So push those that way. And then oh, I guess we can use this to move the Dahan somewhere else. Uh, because we get to... Because forests will then push the Dahan. Anyways, this will heal. Uh, so, do we want to move these Dahan? Not really. I think they're basically where they want to be. So yeah, let's just use forests now. Add a Badlands. Uh, one... Okay, and then we kill everything, which will, and also get one fear from pushing an explorer. Uh, let's push the explorer here, I think. I think the difference between six and four isn't, doesn't really matter. Uh, oh, it might, because the land might actually have three health. Uh, no, it still doesn't matter. I don't know whether it matters. Um, I don't want to push it here. So yeah, let's just do this. Mountains. Okay, well, we need to deal with that, I guess. These are double building. Okay. So, time passes. So, since those are double building, do we need to reclaim and play like Entrancing Apparitions? Get these two explorers out. It's an interesting question. Could also just gain a power card here and hope for something good. I could I could go like looking for a major. Get to isolate a land? That doesn't help that much. Uh what could so could reclaim. I lose my attunement abilities though if I uh, replace this, which is kind of sketchy. Hmm. Hmm. Russia is hard. I was doing pretty well too. Um, so, like, ideally, I would target. Here with air, so two air, one thingy, and push the Dahan this way and the explore some other way. But then, like, this kills us because now we have poached beasts. So we, like, need to deal with that somehow. But I guess we can enchanting apparitions to get them out. Like, get these out of here. Still not great. Um, I 
what happens if all of this is in here? The problem is that our presence is not where it needs to be. Um, yeah, because your lands. Hmm, this is tricky. I think we need to gain a power card, and I think we might need to gain a major. Well, that's very good. Uh, okay. Though I guess that doesn't help that much. Oh, no, we, we need to, uh, right, we reclaim gain a major. That's what we needed to do. Sure. Yeah, I forgot we have a gain of power card on the reclaim. Definitely, like, definitely should be reclaiming because we have, like, this way. This is our way to solve this land, stupidly. Um, but, yeah, I guess we just take voice of command here. Um, okay, and then... We want to take this. Okay. Then now we can play these two. Maybe. Um oh wait, no, no, this doesn't actually solve right, this doesn't actually solve our lands. Huh. Um Yeah, because this doesn't, this this doesn't like this isn't thresholded. Does vo th do I even take voice of command then? Like, probably, but uh, just because it's such a good card. But like, I think I have to still play these two this turn, so that I can entrancing apparitions to not even fully solve this, uh, and then use my right innate in order to push I could do this the problem is like this is ravaging for six I guess that blights and uh, it, that kills these two Dahan but this fights back I guess that's the best I can do um what happens if I add these to it? That adds another four damage, uh, which means that now it'll kill now it'll kill this. Or sorry. No, now it kills so this is ten damage. Now okay, now that's bad. That's really bad. Um Right. Yeah. So I guess going here is the best option. Maybe. Oh, I guess I can do this. Uh, Dahan in my land. That doesn't actually help now. I also don't have to push these to the same place. But like, yeah, I could do this. It's just scary, certainly. Hmm, I don't like this. I really don't like this. Sands, mountains, mountains are ravaging. Or are building. So 
anything else I could be doing here? No. It really, really isn't. I guess I could skip with this, but I don't have any sun tuned. Feels weird that I can't tune anymore. Yeah, but this can't. I, the problem is I can't do this either. I feel like things are a bit too constrained, amusingly. If I do this, then this just dies. Yeah, no, that's bad. So I guess I do have to like shove them into this corner, which is really, really awkward. Or I could shove them into here, which is still awkward. I guess I could have these kill this. That that's actually probably just what I need to do. Have have the triple explorer stack kill off this Dahan and then get counterattacked. Just trade my resources a bit. Okay. Event. Relentless optimism. Sure. Let's disable fear. Uh, most combined invaders plus Dahan. Disease, two damage to Dahan. Uh, interesting. Well, I can spread make the two damage to Dahan like somewhere else. I think I get to. Uh, oh wait, no. Um, that's not how that works. But I, I, I can make this the two damage to Dahan, and I think. Yeah, and then this will kill. What will this? Guy? I don't know how that works. I don't know how how like the optimal damage works. Do I does do I say it kills the six damage Dahan, the six health Dahan still? It's very unclear. Apparently, I have zero Dahan in all of my lands, which is funny. Um, but I did not want to gather Dahan into either of these lands. So on each board, isolate one land. Uh, okay. That is definitely this one because that stops a bunch of builds. Okay, so Wetlands Ravage. Uh, let's do this Ravage first. So it Ravages like this, uh, killing off that Dahan, and then this will kill these off, get one Fear, and push this into here, I think, because this is going to be a Hellhole anyways. Uh, yeah. And, like, it would be ideal if this doesn't explore, certainly. Um, then this will Ravage, so this is 6 damage, which will kill these two and then try to kill this and fail. I, I don't know if that's actually how that works, but uh, I'm, I'm going to choose to believe that's how that works. I don't know. Still healthy. Uh, okay, strong Earth Chatter slowly. That can go... This is not from Ravage, right? This is ra when a Ravage adds Blight. Okay, this is not Ravage adding Blight. Great, so that can be where the Strong Earth will shatter slowly. Okay, and then this will kill that retaliation. Okay, and then the Explore is Coasts. Uh, nice Isolates. Oh, sorry, we I forgot to build. So that's the build, that's the build, and then the Explore is Coasts. Uh, interesting. So thrive together. I think. What, what am I doing here? So this is really unfortunate. Um, thrive together. I think I need to gather this Dahan this way. I don't know what I'm doing about this, though. So, ideally, I would be able to voice of command here, but it, like, somewhat seems hard to get those elements. Or, like get the full elements, but 
Theoretically, I can use voice of command just to like kill, uh, just to like prevent this ravage. So if I can, I guess if I voice of, can I win? Maybe I can win. Maybe that's the play. Yeah, I guess I can win on ravage. This is really bizarre, but okay, sure. Um, then in that case. Gather this Dahan here and attune it with uh no and pay one energy to add a Dahan. Because we need more Dahan, definitely. Time passes. So uh oh I need a Dahan in here. It's interesting. Oh, I guess I can push the Dahan that way. Okay, so that works. So I need this. And I need a... Oh, I guess I just reclaim then? I think this is... No, because I need to place presence too. Okay. I think I... So awkward. Um, I think I need to like place this presence and I need to find a air animal card in order to push these Dahan or at least or at least push one Dahan oh wait actually no I could theoretically let's see I could place a presence here move this way uh, no, it still has the same problem because I need to be able to kill this town and I also need to be able to like get a da an initial Dahan into here. Um, so I need like two Dahan gatherers, not just one. Uh, great, so I need, I need an air animal card basically. Why is this, why does this feel so constrained? Uh, oh, but this also, if I gain a power card, I have to place presence in in the same place as Dahan. So I would need to place presence here or here. Uh, interesting. That doesn't work. Right, that just doesn't work. Uh, I need to get rid of this town somehow. I guess exactly the card Power Storm might win. No, it doesn't. Uh, uh, this is really, really awkward, isn't it? So I push this Dahan. Gather Dahan. I guess I can reclaim. No, so if I reclaim, I need exactly an air animal card in order to push a Dahan this way, specifically this one, because I can't move my presence anymore. Um, and then, so I need an air animal card that pushes Dahan, or I can. I guess I can like try to win off of, um, I, I can try to win with uh, an, like an event or something stupid like that. Uh, reclaim, Let's gather a Dahan, not push a Dahan, so that doesn't help. Yeah, I do really need to play voice of command with a Dahan in here. Uh, so I just need like fast Dahan movement that I don't know if that, I don't know how much that exists. Uh, Veil the Knight's Hunt would work here. Veil the Knight's Hunt would just win the game. Otherwise my option is placing presence. 
And if I just like place presence and gain energy, then I can like do this, gather a Dahan, but then this isn't solved. But like this one would lose me the game. If I place presence and take a power card, then it's basically just the same thing. Oh, I guess I don't, I guess the reclaim is pointless. Yeah, because the reclaim doesn't do anything except um, get me back this uh, air animal card, which isn't enough anyways. So yeah, I wish I could gather, gather like this. Oh wait, can I, what happens if I place here? Gather this, a tune, but I'd have to do this to a tune. No, that doesn't work. Uh, so I guess I should just place a presence and gain a gain a minor. But like I I, I stupidly have to place my presence here. Sadly. Yep. Uh, let's get a minor. Lol, that's close. Almost. Uh, first chorus card, unfortunately, not second. Okay, well, this is the plan. I'm gonna hope. I'm just gonna hope. Oh, also, I guess I can take this, but. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, no, 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 this works, this works, because I, I forgot, I forgot. I can do this. Move here and then drag this here. Um, I think we still need something. Yeah, sorry, I forgot I had the move presence. Okay, that, that actually works. Um, yeah, I think we still need something. And what we need is, uh, so... I have one earth, so this land has three health. We need it to have five health because we can't let this beast die. So anything that defends this works though. So that's nice. Okay, so we get to push two Dahan. So we'll push these, whoops. Yeah, just push these here, I think. I don't think we, yeah, I don't think we need care about these being anywhere else. Then we're going to use Voice of Command here, which will kill both of these. But we also need one more fear, uh, which theoretically can happen from killing this explorer on Ravage. We're ravaging sands and then uh, sands mountains and then sands. These uh, these explorers aren't doing anything. Okay, well. Great, we are down to the event and the uh, and the fear card. So that stupid event that just cost us a beast makes this so much more painful because otherwise we could just like, uh, th th this would be a lot easier. Uh, it is Numinous Crisis, also known as doesn't exist. Um, I'll always skip that. Uh, okay, we got the two fear. <laughs> because we have two or more beasts. Uh, bureaucrats, okay, we'll have one extra build, whatever. And nice, we got our defend five. Okay, GG. Silly game, very silly game. Um, so Terra two, skip all build actions where Nahan outnumber buildings. Uh, great. Uh, oh, we get one energy. Sure, it doesn't matter. So Ravage, Sands and Mountains Ravage. This, this doesn't do anything, these are empty. And then this land uh, has defend five, and in addition, the land has like three health or something, so it'll kill this town from the Dahan. Does that win? I assume so. There we go. Okay, that was way too stressful, um, and also probably took quite a bit because I, I uh, spent a long time just figuring out like what this this like the constraints of this spirit. So okay, comments on the spirit. I feel like. I feel like it's a bit constrained. And okay, maybe that's just because I felt like I went top track. Maybe I should have gone bottom track. 
Um, and maybe, like, I shouldn't have attuned Earth this early, but, like, this thresh this threshold felt, like, pretty hard to hit. I mean, I guess it, like, has a bunch of your starting, uh, starting elements, that's the joke, right? And the other thresholds are a lot more straightforward, but I don't know. It felt weird. Also, like, the fact that I had to replace this when I reclaimed wasn't, uh, felt kind of awkward, like, I, I kind of, I mean, like, that's the point, right? Forcing you to take a chorus card, but it meant that, like, I, I couldn't, like, my left innate was carrying me through the early game, <laughs> really, like, just stopping a build every turn. Uh, what else? What other comments? The uniques felt decent like not much comment there i think I, I like even this card seems fine to me uh russia felt like appropriately difficult i guess but i guess the, the way i would put it is russia felt a bit finicky which is on one hand that's like russia can be a bit finicky but on, but on the other hand it maybe points to the spirit being like powerful if you play it exactly right which is weird, maybe? I don't know. Uh, I guess I would say, like, it felt like there were too, there was too much zero range stuff. Uh, and, like, you know, the move of presence helps with that. But it felt very, very positional. And, like, that's not necessarily a bad thing. But that that's definitely a nit to keep track of. Oh, also just this being, the second chorus element being here feels rough i don't know it, it like it, it feels like i need to go here like i'm not going to like i'm going to do like two growths and then a reclaim usually right like that that's what we saw basically or i guess not not really this was two growths a reclaim and then probably this would be three growths and then a reclaim yeah that, that that's what the pattern here is so like it seems kind of hard to get to this. Uh, oh, though I had to reclaim early to get this card, right? Um, it, it seems kind of hard to get to this, uh, get the right thresholds for your uh, second chorus card, especially when, like, if you look at this, right, when you get your first chorus card that doesn't really increase your power right uh you're not you're not scaling that much you you kind of just you kind of lose your main innate because this this is like a tuning dahan which is nice but uh, i at, at some point you need to get like another effect like this one right and it's weird that like this is the second one to get replaced because or, I mean it's not that weird it just feels like this was doing stuff and this one wasn't doing stuff like obviously the attuned Dahan are good but I don't know it's hard to exactly articulate what I felt was off but I, overall I very much enjoyed this period I think this is very well done uh, I think it's also like just in a pretty good place these are just like very minor nitpicks as to like the balance of the spirit and and how it felt definitely would have to get uh, some more games in like trying uh, going bottom track instead of top track as well it just felt like my starting hand being five or six energy meant that like i needed to take this two energy spot there just like wasn't a point to not taking this which felt bad like it felt like i couldn't go here unless i got really lucky on my power card draws for uh, cheap cards. Uh, but yeah, I, I guess I can like replace immediately replace my uniques with uh, cards from my right innate, but like that also feels bad, right? It feels bad to replace a unique before it gets played. So like if I want to play my expensive hand, I need to go top track, and that feels bad. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching. I hope this was... Uh, e even if kind of long-winded and just me struggling through figuring out how to optimize this spirit. I hope this was entertaining.
yeah, I'll probably do another one of these. I definitely want to get more games in with the spirit. So yeah, see you in the next one.